at WoW. Kira. Hello. Mm. Water. Hello. Hi, everybody. How you doing? It's me. Fortunately for you. Yes, I also prefer me alive. I do like water. Everyone take a sip and tell me what you're sipping. Um, I tried a new caffeine solution today. Radia needs to restart e this game. Does it mean we're going to get titties soon? We're not going to get titties because we're going to we're going to block the titties with the titty blocker. Don't you worry. Um, so I tried a new caffeine solution. It does not deliver me enough caffeine. So I might be a little scatterbrained today. Might lose focus a little bit. Uh, I might lose my train of thought and words and sentences. It, it gives me about like a third of the caffeine I needed, apparently. Um, Uh, Feeds everyone tagalo. I will take some tagalongs. So that if I act weird, that's why. Um, the drink, as as a drink, it's delicious, except for the too much ginger. I added too much ginger, and it's a little spicy. More so spicy, I couldn't even really taste it. Um, with less ginger, though, it will be a delicious drink. But I need to figure out the caffeine. Uh, someone recommended me caffeine melts in this channel. I will be looking into those. Thank you for that. Um, otherwise, at this point, caffeine pills or caffeine powder might end up having to take the stage. Because uh, it's not like I have insurance, so I can't get fucking ADHD medication. Uh huh. Um... That's not coming for quite a while because signups are not allowed outside of November. So I'm... Oh, you should try ginger shots. I love those little guys, but they're too spendy to buy regularly and too annoying to make every day. But yes, I will. I will self-medicate if I need to. Uh, that's part of it. Also, the most delicious milkshake in the world is peanut butter with ginger. I didn't know that. I might try that with some blueberries. I do have the peanut butter. I also have oat milk. And I have blueberries. And ginger. So that sounds like it might be a delicious option. Thank you. I said peanut butter with ginger radia. Yeah. Peanut butter with ginger. And also maybe some blueberries. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, so, oh, I don't know. No blueberries, Radia. Why no blueberries? I love blueberries. Ow. Peanut butter and ginger. Why no blue? I love blueberries, though. Oh. <laughs> hey, Nick, how you doing? But yeah, I'll figure it out. Mm, if I gotta cut like caffeine pills and quarters or whatever, I'll, I'll do it. Okay. No, this is uncaffeinated, right? Uh, everybody lend me your strength. Because we're gonna restart Tormented. Uh, turns out Tormented doesn't make its save points very obvious. I might even need y'all to point it out to me. Because I lost an hour of progress and have to restart the game. Um, it's not that big of a deal. I Get you blue boys gone, you writer's fellow. Uh, but it's not too bad. Like I can zoom through what I did in an hour. Right. What am I doing? Um. Okay. Uh. I can. I need water. Tell me what you're sipping. 
The Ray demands it. DP. No, you can sip that. Well. Hmm. Oh, okay. <laughs> Probably better to start the game, right? Otherwise, I'm just gonna. Who mentioned tips? We probably better start the game, otherwise, I'm gonna like just chatting for like three hours. Uh, you know what? Maybe that's the solution. If I want to do a just chatting stream, maybe I just need to not be caffeinated. It's way easier. God, it's so much easier. How long has it been? It's been almost 10 minutes. Okay. Tormented Souls. Read you would us. enjoy that more than this game. I don't know. I mean, the amount I played was pretty fun, except for the save point thing. Let's, let's bring, bring controller over here. Listen to me. Uh, so if I remember correctly... Really, do you doubt the Monobi? Why am I moving? Stop, stop that! Okay. If I remember correctly, uh, this game had some titties in the beginning. So we're gonna set up something real quick. An anti-titty measure. Um... Tito and Pussy. I don't know if it had Pucci visible. We're just gonna call that titty blocker. And for the image, let's see. What do I want for the image for the titty blocker? Okay. When you see titty blocking Squidward, use mono beta titty block. When you see titty blocking Squidward, that is when you know there are titties on screen. If you wish, you can be delighted by the presence implied of titties. All right, here we go. We're gonna move that below Monogrub, so Monogrub still has access. And above me. Titty block. Okay, here we go. Boom, 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 boom. Double titty block. Wait, can I do multiple actions on this? Hold on. Wait, can I make it so a sound plays when I show the layer? Oh no, I can't. I can't, because I was going to have like the, the vine boom show up. <laughs> Just like boom. <laughs> oh no, that would have been so fun. I will make the sound for you. Thank you, baby. Boom, boom. Thank you. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I gotta look this up. I know this is entirely uncaffeinated Ray talking, but I need to look this up. Stream deck multi action. 
Oh, you can do this. You can do that. Okay, here we go. You can do that. Oh my God, this is gonna be great. Here we go. Hey, don't you worry about me. I appreciate your patience, but we have to do the Squidward. go y'all this is gonna be worth it I promise okay cool now on We have to find Vine Boom. Why is there a delay in Vine Boom? Do not tell me Vine Boom. Okay. Audacity, open it up so good. I'm opening up fucking Dark Audacity. I am grabbing Vine Boom. I am removing the delay because Vine Boom should not have a delay. This is important work we're doing. this one yeah that's the one okay great now we export that as mp3 custom vine boom change the file this is gonna be worth it I promise you there we go you ready why is there a delay on that There it is. Why is there a click at the end of that? Why is there a click? No one click? Whatever. Fine, it clicks. Okay, Squidward Vine Boom, done. Are you happy? Squid Boom. 
It's called Squid Boom. That's our sensor for tonight. Everyone, thank you. Everyone say thank you, Squid Boom. Thank you. Okay. I wonder how many people came and left during that. All right. Squid Boom. I, uh, uh, controller to take out. Oh, wait, no, I want the controller. Right. Okay, here we go. You need to touch up these walls. Why are you dressed like a Final Fantasy character? That's not like a condemnation. I'm like, I'm, I'm curious. What, like, why? Are you going somewhere? Are you going to a convention? A letter for me? I never receive letters. Ow. Sorry. She's Canadian, which you will 100% hear very shortly. From John Doe, Wildburger Hospital, Winter Lake, Blackwood Island, Canada. Ah! My head, what was that? You think you can just abandon us here? Oh, is that a boo? Two weeks since I received that letter from the Wildberger Hospital. Since then, I haven't been fine. I can't get out of my head the image of those little girls. I can't sleep. And when I am able to fall asleep, it's only to dream horrible nightmares. I need to know what's going on. What's the meaning of all of this? I'm going to the Wildberger Hospital in hopes of finding some answers about this strange photo. I need to know what's going on. Again, it is very pretty here. Squid Boom, save us! Only I can see it. Haha, <laughs> y'all can't see it. Thank you, Squid Boom. <laughs> I just like being able to... Ow, why do I keep hitting that? I like being able to do it. Oh, that's crunchy. Oh. Why was I connected to the respirator? Sorry, sorry. I don't know if this is a boat. 
Respirators and oscilloscopes. What did they do to me? What have they done to me? Who could have done such a horrible thing to me? Why? <laughs> God. Brown leather jacket with blue jeans. Interesting. William Wildberger's Diary. Today is the happiest day of my life after all the suffering. Y'all have read this. I'm not going to read it out loud again because we went through it in the first hour. Y'all can just like read this and then I'll just give you a second. I'm going to I'm going to exhaust my voice if I read all of these diary en entries again. Okay. Ah, why? I'll read the new ones out loud, but not the ones I have to repeat in the first hour. Wait, can we change our outfit? We can! Oh, that's pretty cute! That's pretty cute! an enormous pocket watch. It is 12.35. Once again. One. Two. Three. Ah! Three. Five. Combination padlock. Grab the wrench. This teaches us how to do simple puzzles. We're going to go ahead and turn that once. Do not let shadows embrace you. What does that mean? There we go. that being pretty intuitive when I first tried. Wait, can we? Hold on. Hold on. Oh! Oh! Okay, oh, hold on. Hold on. Oh, yeah! We got it! We got it! <laughs> I can only get it for a split second, though. Oh, that's good. That's good. That's good. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Take it. Wish there was a button for that, but whatever. Can't we just, like, escape out the window? There's... There's an open window right here. We could just... Just leave. I mean, I would just leave. One sec. I mean, it's pretty obvious that shit's going down, right? I would just leave. I'd be like, hey, uh, police? I went into this abandoned place. Yeah, I know I shouldn't have, but someone knocked me out and stole my fucking eye. 
need answers. I don't need answers. You can keep your answers. Waiting room. Someone stole my god dang eye. Breastfeeding. I know, I'm just looking. Because I want this. Beautiful heading to Lothnes once again. I mean, it looks great, I'll give you that. The game looks great. All right, let me see if I can spot it. Hold on. Oh, jeezy Pete's. Hmm. Stall gives me the creeps. Okay. Examination room. That won't work. Okay, let me see if I can spot it. An organ. Oh, you can get this early? I just never went in here. Oh, is it this? Fucking is. Tape is required to save progress. Covered in blood. Got it, Reeks. I don't dare lift the sheet. I didn't find any tapes, by the way, until that point. I guess you find your first one in here. So I'm going to hold on to that. Until I get a little farther in. Tell mannequin of the human torso. This is a safe room, though. Good to know. Nails. Glad to see very few items are only a spawning once I'm in danger. insufficiency and requires an immediate transplant. That's way at 11.34 p.m. due to cardiac arrest. The rat buttons and make rigor mortis have an animal removed from their hand. Okay, so we have to assemble the heart and put it in the corpse once we find that again. Great! Love it! Love it, love it, love it. It's been mutilated. What the hell is going on? I wouldn't... Oh. Oh, yeah. Splish, splash. I was taking a bath. All right, you got it. I want that gas mask. This is very pretty. Don't like 
like that. I don't like that at all. The X-ray room. What the hell is going on here? You, you look too close to the mic. My child, you are pale. What happened to you? A person in a wheelchair with knives in his hands was chasing me. Oh, it's you. Don't you remember me? I'm the town priest. We met here in the chapel only a couple of days ago. What? I'm sorry. I don't remember sorry. you. I certainly don't remember coming <laughs> here before. I love that. To be clear, I'm not making fun of Canadian accents. I love Canadian accents. They're great. I'm just like, I'm enchanted by them. I see. Perhaps I'm mistaken. I'm old and get confused every now and again. Sorry. What is going on here, Father? Where is everybody? The patients and the hospital personnel have been transferred to the new hospital in town. This old mansion has been left pretty much abandoned. Yeah, for real. Why are all the lights off? I don't like this. Anything could be lurking in the dark. I feel the same. Something evil is happening here. Something wicked that hides in the shadows. Is there a way to turn on the lights? The old generator has been playing up. It happens sometimes. Go to the end of the hall and through the door that leads to the generator room. You can restore the power from there. I see. I'll do that. Wait. Take this with you. It's not much, but it might be useful. It's dangerous to walk around the mansion unarmed. Man's wearing a puffy coat with a giant fucking crucifix. That is a very specific look. Thank you, Father, but what are you going to do without a weapon? My child, with a Bible in my hand, God protects me. Nail gun. This is cool music. An instructional sheet. Oh, I can back dodge? Hold on. No, that sh that fired. It's Xbox controls. Hey, Treskits. That is useful, though. Welcome back, Kate. Hey. He just keeps tracking me like that. Thank you. Crowbar. Yes. You can still back dodge. Honestly, and... A couple people are gonna know what I'm talking about. This feels like 811 music. Massive goddamn radiation suits. Massive radiation suits. Like six foot eight radiation suits.
I did not check these lockers before. I was tired last night. Sorry. <laughs> Remember, this, this, this. Triscuits, you didn't see. There was Titty that I had to hide, so... I have a squid boom button. I had to hide Titty. Squid boom. try to resist the urge not to use that inappropriately. Okay, so now we can go to this. Now, if I remember last time, that enemy outside took literally 10 nails to kill. Let's see if that happens again, because I do need to be passing through that area quite a bit. Condition is fine. Abuse the squid boom? How could you say that? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Dip the nails in Taco Bell Inferno sauce. Oh, you mean medium heat sauce? Is that what you're talking about? They're, uh, they're medium hot, Inferno. <laughs> okay. Um, basement. Let's see to the morgue. I mean, it tastes fine, but it's medium hot. Hmm. Oh, I love spice. I'm not like wild about spice, but I do enjoy it a lot. I'd say I can handle more than your average American, but not like a tremendous amount. Let's see, we have a heart piece. <laughs> heart piece. Um Crowbar, ring tape. What? What? Right, the alien puzzle. What is, what's going on? Malfunction maternity. Bulbs are flickering. Yeah. Did I make an innuendo and not even realize it? Yet. 
water switched off. Milk. restroom. Dentist room. The examination room is through there. I should probably save, actually. I should probably save in the examination room. That's the wrong way. Milk time? Why is it milk time? What happened? Go. Oh, damn it. What about the Tismu tribe? I haven't read this yet. According to the latest archaeological discoveries in Winter Lake Island, Tismu tribe resided on the island for more than 500 years before being discovered by European settlers. Proof of this is an ancient underground cemetery found deep inside a cavern on the island shore dating from the 10th century. And 286 skeletons belonging to 10 year old children have been unearthed. Uh oh. So far in the underground cemetery, all the bones are buried in pairs, and the experts suspect that these were twins buried together. Ooh! I thought I broke it for a second. Here's the other hard piece. It's really hard to actually bait. He gets mad. Woo! More nails. What's up, bud? Ow, I got cocky. Okay, this is where he followed his father to the catacombs and, or the sewers, and then his father put on a suit with a bunch of other guys, you know, all had giant hammers, and they were just like, straight up like, ritualizing the hammers and like, we're almost gonna kill him. <laughs> Ow! This is bad. I gotta go, I gotta go. I gotta fucking go. No! I gotta save. I gotta save immediately. And I might have to save, save scum my way out of here. Wait, nope. An old magnetophone. It looks like it works. Recording my progress might be useful if anything happens to me. Why'd you say it like my that? My name is Caroline Walker. I came to Wild Burger Mansion seeking information about two girls in a photograph I received in the mail a couple of weeks ago. Why'd you say that like that? The last thing I remember before losing consciousness was arriving at the hospital and entering the mansion's main hall. I remember pain and then nothing. I woke up sometime later connected to a ventilation machine and my eye had been removed. Why? Why would someone do such a thing? I don't know what the hell is going on in this place, but I need answers. Every time I close my eyes, I see those girls. Am I going insane? I mean, you're obviously one of them. What happens with these kind of things? Well, there go, uh, there goes my thing. Oh now. Here we go. Here, here it begins. It begins. It begins. You ready? Okay. Okay. So. Let's try something. Uh, nope. <laughs> uh, 
Oh boy, howdy. So it is allowed to move before I'm allowed to move. That's the thing. It, it's, it, it's animation can start before I'm permitted to move. <laughs> now, how the fuck do I heal? Oh, okay. Oh, don't have any of that yet. Uh, I need to go to the maternity ward, which is right here. God, of course there is. Excuse me? No, what do you mean it doesn't fit? Doesn't fit? Increase the fucking size of the thing then. I'm looking right at it. You can literally just do it. This early? This early. Okay, you don't have to tell me the solution. Is it stupid? <laughs> Is it a stupid solution? I'm in the, the fucking Maternity ward. Okay, well, there you go. You fucker. Okay, how's this? No, nothing. I could just. I can see the, I can see it. I can see the switch. I, if I just crank that a little, it'll fit. Fine. Yeah, okay, okay. I get it. mannequins are kept under these sheets. Pardon? 
Oh no, my UVs. Oh my god, it's just a shadow dimension. Okay, you got it, bud. You got it. Not even a single word, huh? Hmm. Hmm. Morphine! I just heard something. Yep. Okay, you can't stun them out of their hit. It's alive. That was too much ammo. Back in danger immediately. Fuck you. Oh. Way bigger than this baby, though. It was so much bigger. The pieces were like, okay. Surgical tools, they don't appear to be in good condition. Seemed almost alive for a moment. Seemed almost alive for a moment. Seemed almost alive for a moment. I just say it three times. There is melee combat, but as you saw, they don't get stun locked. So, uh, <laughs> does not seem advisable. Water switched up. Oh, these are sinks. So this is literally a mirror, okay? What? I just need to crank the fucking wheel. Oh. oh no, you can force that. Don't even try to tell me you can't force that. Okay, whatever. You know, if horror game developers learned of the concept of leverage multiplying force, a lot of these puzzles would be gone. Like, let's be honest about that. Leverage is a force multiplier. Yeah, I'm, I'm aware that I'm injured, thank you. Well, nice, okay. Middle T handle, you mean a socket wrench? The examine the waiting room is where I need to What? The waiting room is where I need to go through to save and it's what I think it's behooves me to immediately try to kill these fuckers. I can't see. You made it so I can't see. You made it so I can't fucking see. Ooh, I'm getting a little tired of you already. Isn't that fun?
Yeah, well, the problem is it's not possible to kill them and it's not possible to make it to the save room. And it's not possible to get the heal. So... I've got a bit of a problem. If I know of any morphine I'm missing? At least in Silent Hill games, you could forcibly turn your view. There's one. How you doing? We're doing Tormented Souls. <laughs> it's um, an RE slash Silent Hill like, and it is. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Let's just say, hmm. I really don't like this doll. All right, where is this morphine we all talking about? vending machine is out of order, smash it open and see if there's any drinks in there. I better... Honestly, I kind of better save. Oh, no problem. Feel free to lurk. Welcome, welcome. It has morphine. Oh, didn't even see that. Oh, God, that's so much better. Okay, so I got the socket wrench and... Look, in this kind of survival situation, if I'm seeing evidence is like supernatural powers going off, I'm throwing social mores like don't steal from corporations out the window. Okay? Exactly. Glass is so smashable. The Nightmares, painted by Henry Fuseli in 1781. It's about sleep paralysis. It depicts a woman in a deep sleep with a demonic incubus crouched in her chest. This recreation is amazing. Almost looks like the original. I mean, yes, you're correct, Ink, but that's one I like. <laughs> I'm I'm shuffling my social mores. Suddenly, I only believe that it, it, all people need to wear overalls, or it's inappropriate. And you you can't use your left foot to take a step on a Tuesday. That kind of thing. I'm rude now. I'm rude now. Okay, I need the socket. Which I don't think I've checked the delivery room. I might need to go downstairs or upstairs? I don't know which. I'm rude now. Right, okay, there was... Judith beheading Holofernes. Caravaggio in 1602. Fixed Judith beheading the Assyrian general Holofernes in his tent after charming him. The recreation of Caravaggio's work is outstanding. It almost looks like the original. Honestly, after going through art school, the two artists that stayed with me the most... Uh, that enough that I know their names are Caravaggio and Frazetta. 
No, that's a problem. No problem, Hank. I swear the, the socket was down here. Was the socket down here? I know Frazetta's way more of a contemporary artist than Caravaggio, but like, still. I heard Caravaggio was kind of a delinquent and like ran around in gangs and beat up other young men. Or am I thinking of someone else? but one thing that always interested me was art history. More morphine. Okay. Sorry for yelling. Uh, God, okay. I will take that. We read that last time. Yeah, that's fine. Also, a lot of the, a lot of times, the people who get to tell you things for the first time are very excited to tell you. You may find what you're looking for in the library. Uh, ¿Dónde está la biblioteca? How can I find the library? <laughs> okay. Uh... It's on the second floor of the east wing. Take the stairs in the main hall. Oh, you'll need to unlock the door in the waiting room. Thank you. Take care, Father. Y'all, when they say eat the mic, they don't mean like literally, okay? Okay, 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 okay. That's the generator room, this is amineration. Oh, generator room, basement morgue is closed. Crunch, munch, munch. X-ray room, Oops, I did, there's no options for me down here. I must have found the socket upstairs. Uh, by the way, Ink, the reason I sound like I have prior knowledge is because last night I played this game for about an hour and uh, I didn't know how to save. So when I died, the aforementioned, there we go, uh, Crawly Beasties, I couldn't reload my game. <laughs> Like, frankly, the, the, the balance of this game, very reminiscent of PS1 games in that it is not terribly well balanced. Okay, so this is socket wrench. It doesn't fit it. That's a, it's literally a hex key. I wonder if I can use this to unlock that gate. Slowly starting to piece this place together in my brain. My brain meets her absorbing it. Evil Ikea. Oh. I should go there. Yeah, there it is. Oh, we have to combine it. If it gone halfway up and it said, it's stuck, I would have been like, murder. Pharmacy service window, I can't see anything on the other side. Would have been like murder, let's be honest. Fiendish meatballs and slashed potatoes. Excuse me? Hello? Hello? <gasps> Yo. This place kind of fucks though. Form grip strength. We need a letter. This place does kind of fuck. Look at those floors. 
Look at those god dang floors. We love them. God, yes, I love a patterned wood tile floor. Why does this look like the inside of a police station? <laughs> hmm. Old piano. Sadly, I don't know how to play. Like, this woodworking is legit sexy. Can I steal these? I'm going to steal these tiles. I'm going to steal them, and I'm going to take them home. Where's the car? I need, like, 40 of these fuckers. Exactly. Pay phones out of service. Like, I think each of these has got to weigh, like, what? Three to four pounds. I could probably fill the back seat. Like, just stack them vertically. Like, books, just fill the back seat. I'm thinking like 40, 50 tiles. That's enough to do a whole apartment. I rent a U-Haul. I found an, an old abandoned building to scavenge. Triscuits. We have to be gay, do crime. Exactly. It's perfect. There's still wood, though. Wildburger Hospital map west for. This is a big fucking map. Okay. Um. I have to get my bearings. Oh fuck you. We're not doing this. All right. It's time to test something out. Didn't expect to die to that. It's fine. We saved. We saved. We just have to go grab the socket and uh, use this morphine. We're good. Crowbar's kind of shit. The problem is with Silent Hill, uh, you had the option of uh, stun locking enemies. You know? If you hit an enemy fast enough with a good enough rhythm, you could stun lock an enemy to death. Except for the biggest enemies. And that was like the basis, you know? That was the basis of the combat system was you found an enemy's rhythm, you knew when to back away. With this one, it doesn't appear that there is a safe rhythm. Um, if you hit them tw once, they stop. Oh, fuck me running. Oh. I better get the lighter up before I die. Yeah, you basically have to spray and pray. If you hit them once, they stagger, but then any further hits reduce the stagger until suddenly they're just, they're just not staggering anymore. So if they want you to hit once and then back off and wait, I'm not interested. <laughs> I'm just not interested in doing that. So as long as I can manage it, I'm just gonna avoid fights or shoot them from a distance. Why you can't hit their oxygen tanks, I don't know, but, you know, whatever. Also, one thing I will say is, there are a lot of things from classic games that we need to learn from, and maybe think about reincorporating and modifying and, you know, advancing as time goes on. Um, Resource-based saving in the standard difficulty is not one of those things we need to retain from old games. Like, genuinely, you don't need to do that. And in fact, I would say, don't do that. Do you, do you get me? <laughs> you should be able to just save freely. OK. 
Okay. Uh, well, one thing a lot of older games did well uh, that we don't have to do as much anymore is they worked around severe technological limitations. Uh, example given, Silent Hills Fog. I think that we should look at our limitations that exist and look at the limitations that are self-imposed limitations and we should honestly once in a while take some self-imposed limitations like especially regarding optimization right if silent hill didn't exist and you had a game engine that did not handle long distance rendering pretty well like unreal does not handle that really well with that amazing optimization i would say it would be a great idea to, to, for a horror game to limit the view radius and use fog instead. That would still be a valid choice. But because we have good enough performance without like heavy optimization anymore, then people just don't really try to optimize much anymore. And that's just an example, but I think things like that are mistakes. Okay, well... Now here's the problem, it, it moves almost as fast- Oh my god, there's two of them! My patience with this game is wearing thin. All right. So three hits from anything apparently kills you. I haven't even gotten to the... Oh boy. Okay. You know, I will, I will keep trying. I will try to stick it out. We'll, we'll keep going. Because aesthetically, there's some great stuff in here. Aesthetically. Aesthetically. Oh, Ink, you haven't even seen the default outfit. Hold on. No. Yeah. This is the default outfit. Straight up looking like a Final Fantasy character. It's very, it's very interesting. Like, if it wasn't wildly out of place, I would say it was amazing. But I'm sorry, it's wildly out of place. Believe in me, thank you. Someone has to. Yeah. So they give you a copy of a map and then they give you a map to carry around. You're walking around map. So we have to avoid combat, but the problem is the enemies will linger outside of exits, so we can't get them too close to the exit because they'll just they'll just stay there is the problem. Uh, so I'm not sure what to do about those guys. I don't know of any workarounds. You know, it's a real shame because this is a beautiful game. This might have benefited from getting more playtesters, I think. 
if they had a bunch of people who were only like just very good at these kinds of games like Resident Evil games then that's going to skew the difficulty curve like a lot down here first if there's an enemy in the first room down here I'm I'm just all right I'm just going to wonder if it's even worth it <laughs> Oh my god. How many puzzles? Just light the gas on fire. Oh, don't lose uh, don't worry. I'm not losing hope or anything. I'm just like I got my limits. We're going to try to stick it out tonight. We're going to try to stick it out. How many puzzles? Um, 45. No, 46. Thirty-eight. Twenty-nine. Help from an angel comforting her grieving sister. How do you know sister? Seventeen. I mean, it's going to be 22, right? Obviously, it has to be 22. That's fair. No scraping. Okay, cool. Are you taking a little sneak peek? Is that what's going on? Are you peeking ahead? A little sneak a Rooney. Seems to be alive. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna go ahead of that. I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna do that. Oh my god! Well. That enemy design fucking rules. Uh, but I don't think I can go over there. <laughs> I am pretty sure. kill me so bad it makes you look stupid <laughs> look at you you can't even swing your sword to the side you look fucking you look so fucking stupid right now you want to kill me so bad oh oh what 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 if i oh 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 no i'm not gonna oh what if i did it though oh, no ah uh, <laughs> stupid Edge them till they snap. <laughs> There's a tag for someone, all right. Okay, here we go. Corridor of death. Got nothing else I can do. What?
right and then down, I guess. Stop turning me away from the enemies. I see what you're doing there. You are turning me away from the enemies. Damn it. One hit and I'm dead. I will say that this um, this game design seems pretty hostile to the player. Like, it, it genuinely seems to want to give you a hard time. The smash statue of Jesus looks like it fell off the frog. Uh, the, sorry, what? Oh, I misread that. No, the dodge is basically nothing. It it gives you zero frame advantage. It just prolongs the, the engagement. Now watch, I was gonna say, watch there be an enemy on the wall that the moment it comes into view, it slashes me. Understood. Thank you. Peanut butter. Wait. Oh, that peanut butter is... Oh, that's not the color peanut butter is supposed to be. Okay. That's bad. Okay, you got it. Not touching that. You won't leave this place. Yeah. Fermented peanut butter. Dried remains. These human bones? What the hell's going on here? Just mix it up a little bit. You think the oil's separated? Is that is that what you think is the problem? Is there nothing in? Oh, it smells awful. These people be eating people. Well, I'll take your word for it. Mmm, spoonful of that nice peanut butter. I mean, enemy. Oh. Well, that's pretty cool. Oh, fuck you. That's a wheelchair guy. No! Ah, ha, ha. every time. There is no variation. Ten every single time. And eight for the other guys. You should vary it up a little bit. Insert disk to write new keyword. After the door. See that? Oh my god. Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. I I I I gotta. We have to, right? We have to. How did I do that the first time? There it is. There's a spot right there. Come on. Scrape it. Oh god, I must have hit the like the one in a million on that one. Damn it. Oh! That is so inconsistent. What is going on? Oh, 
no. Oh, come on. Get me up there. I want to get up there. I need to. I need to. Damn it. <laughs> I just wanted to get up there. Okay, let's try it from over here. That's true. Bottle of nitric acid that can corrode metal over time. Over, yeah, like hours. Really? No, I just mean that. Oh, well, okay. All right, fine. I had to try, right? I had to try. Iron door knocker shaped like a hand holding a ball. Okay. A water cooler next to a priceless antique vase. It feels out of place somehow. me, boy. I'm the PS5, speaking to you from inside your brain. Listen to me, boy. Leave the girl. We don't need her. We'll play cowboy guy. Come with me and play my games. We'll have cowboy times in space. Do to do, do. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God, a battery can fit here. Got it. Got it. Got it. Do to do, do. Yeah. Okay. Already in here. Good God. Okay. I feel like this is the kind of map you're supposed to get to know slowly over time and then be like intimately familiar with it as the at the end of the game and then you just run back and forth doing puzzles you shouldn't have come here yeah i would choose not to if i had the choice x-ray imagery showing a heart the figure seems familiar oh that's the um that's the statue out in the main hall. Hmm. Rotate your saves, folks. Especially with a game like this, are you kidding me? Good God, okay, more? That was the studio. Which means... Oh, fuck off. Save. This is the time to. Oh, right. Nope. Can't do that. It will kill us. Even though I could, you know, one hand the crowbar, I look. I could. I could one hand the crowbar. 
you have a good night, Crime. I wonder. Nope, it blocks. There's gonna be a solution to that later. Wildberger's diary. I was sitting in a hill under a big leafy tree. How long was I there? I could smell the grass and hear the sound of leaves dancing in the wind just over my head. Small, shapeless figures. Every time I start to read, I start to yawn. And this is not me being bored. This is some sort of weird Pavlovian response that I have to being at my job where I have to read a lot of things verbatim. Every time I start to read something verbatim, I start to yawn. <laughs> I hate it. Small shapeless figures were moving to Fuck! Ah. I could hear a weak voice traveling with the wind. I did not understand what it was saying. I did not pay much attention to it. The snake crawled up to me, hidden in the grass. It gave me no time to stand up, wrapping around my feet and climbing up my leg. I tried to scream, but the snake had already sunk in its fangs in my flesh. I felt the poison burning its way through me. I winced in pain and let the snake fall away, lost in the grass. The pain got stronger and stronger, and the voices there were and the voices were the only whispers in the wind. And the voices that were the only whispers in the wind became clearer. Their sounds turned into syllables, the syllables turned into words. The pain worsened and the sun. The sun which was bright and warm before it became cold, surrounded by a stainless metal halo. The words turned into people who's... I'm sorry, the yawn is coming. Who surrounded me. One was holding my hand. Push, Maria, push. That was her having the kids. Oh, fuck you. Oh, you go upstairs. You go right upstairs. Okay. Wouldn't have thought that. Oh, fuck off. It's dark in here. I can't do anything. The young child's diary. Late one night, grandfather... Hmm. Start to yawn again. Late one night, Grandfather Noah came into our room. He was accompanied by two strangers wearing leather suits that covered him entirely. They used their smelly leather hands to cover our faces, preventing us from crying out. We were all left almost unable to breathe. He took us somewhere underground, put us in strange cross-shaped metal beds. Our hands and feet were tied in metallic bands. A group of the student figures surrounded us, all of them covered by the same material and holding giant hammers. In the center of the room was Grandfather, watching everything. Although he was not wearing a suit, his mere stare terrified me. He came close and laughed. My dear granddaughters, it's time for you to finally fulfill your destiny. Emma couldn't stop crying. She begged him to let us go, but he moved over the door and ordered a suit of men to get us ready for the ritual. That is dire. That is extremely dire. Oh, bud, what's up? That's just a... What do you mean you can't untie it? I can see the knot right there! Okay. Look at that. Look at that. That's it. That's it. Or, look at that. You literally just pull it until the rope snaps or the latches snap. You could just wedge it into the knot and forcefully loosen the knot could use a nail to pick away at the edges of the rope and fray it until it comes loose. Pipe with an attached handle. Smells like sulfur. You know...
one of the tropes that bothers me the most in horror specifically is when characters refuse to attempt novel solutions as in they refuse to try to work around problems the door is locked oh we can't leave without the key why the windows are closed we can't open the windows looks like we're trapped there's rope we need scissors to cut the rope no you don't no you do not <laughs> I just okay one might argue that I take things too literally and it's supposed to be metaphor but if a story is supposed to be entirely metaphor I'm probably not gonna, I'm not gonna want to read the story if do you get me because I get me shotgun part oh wow okay interesting There's not really much I can do in the main hall. Um, we could use the crowbar to smash the statue and reveal the heart, I guess. Although that is a very large heart. We can't use it because we equipped it. Bud? Bud? No. Hold the fucking phone, bud. Bud? Friendo? What you doing, bud? Crowbar didn't fit, huh? <laughs> mm. Ooh. 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 Okay, 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 okay. Now, Mono, I realize why you told me you couldn't wait to watch me play this. What do we got to get to smash the statue, I wonder? Unless... Nope, didn't think so. Nope. What do we got to get... Oh, is it a hammer? Is it a five pound hammer? Or wait, a hammer and a chisel? Or is it another smaller crowbar? Is it a scalpel? I don't mean to seem petulant, y'all. I really don't. But it, sorry if it's coming off that way. A knife, a fucking... Okay. I really don't mean to seem petulant. I, I would... I just... I... Beg people who design these games. I am begging you with all of my heart and soul to think through the logic of any situation. I'm sorry, but if you give me a crowbar, eight out of 10 of these puzzles are already solved. Now, I don't have a problem with a puzzle like, okay, okay, okay. Let's take a look at this. I'm assuming that there is a, a piece that we have to slot into here that will unlock this huge, heavy, bolted plate. That, on this kind of door, perfect sense. Makes perfect sense. That is too heavy for a crowbar. I would need hours and hours to take down that door. And by that point, I'd probably attract the attention of enemies. But if you can't cut a rope because you have the wrong kind of cutting implement. Explain why. You have to explain why. You know that, right? 
Otherwise, people are just going to be baffled. What is all the letters? A, there was a C, there was an F in one area. What does that mean? A puzzle, I guess? Hmm. Now, I did go to the restroom. I couldn't get to the laundry because there was an enemy, like, right here. Shower room was closed. You should tell me that. Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead, spoil, spoil me on the statue. This is the chapel. Kitchen already gotten in. The warehouse already gotten in. The closet. I don't think I've... No, I did do that. That's, okay, that's kind of fine. That's, that's kind of fine. It, it, I was on the wrong track. I thought I had to break the statue to get the heart or something. I was on the wrong track. That's kind of fine. It's not too terrible. Um, or I'm going to get a stethoscope. The warehouse? I have not been to. Wait. I've already been in the place with the step with the stethoscope. by a rude trick. What? That the fact that the many stethoscopes I've crossed were not the right stethoscope? Fuck it. Well, there we go. Wait. Oh, shit. Question for you: If these are doors, uh, if these are harm doors, <laughs> with like turning on the light trivializes them, why exactly don't they just die in one hit? Sincere question. Get some nails at least. There's the stethoscope. Okay, if I had seen the, te the stethoscope, I would have, I, I would have tried it. No joke, I, I would have, genuinely. Never understood the appeal of abstract art. Whoever had this room was crafty as fuck, I love it. They had hobbies. Oh, Maria Wilberger, probably. Yeah, gamer trap, exactly. <laughs> William returns from his week-long trip today. I can see his car from my window, slowly drawing closer. I was unable to go with him, for I was not feeling well. What am I supposed to do now? What should I tell him? Probably nothing. One look will be enough. It won't ne be necessary for, him to say any for me to say anything at all. I and my face are staying silent. We'll only postpone the inevitable. Before I have a chance to sweeten my words, I will stab him with the ugly truth. He will look at me and know you lost the baby, didn't you? Okay, so they had lost babies before having twins. So, 
it, and this is because I've seen this story like three times. I'm guessing the father embarked on some sort of like forbidden ritual uh, to have uh, the baby survive to term. And part of the cost of the ritual is that they're born as twins and something about twins is forbidden on this land. And it leads to like dire consequences and makes some folks go whack a duty and uh, invites the dark mirror world into our world, which allows evil spirits access to our world. I'm assuming that's the plot, right? And that she's actually one of the twins who's reincarnated into a body uh, as the result of the other twins power or sacrifice possibly and given the chance to live a normal life, but she's being pulled back by her grandfather who is uh, been converted into like a, an evil dark spirit. Tell me if I'm right. If I'm right, I'll just quit right now. Like if I'm right, I'm done. If I'm right, I'm, I'm done with the game. There's no reason to play it. Fair enough. I think Mono probably knows. <laughs> Anyway, I've seen that story like three or four times, so I'm going to be mildly disappointed if it's the same story again. I'm doing stethoscope. It's going to wake up at some point. Locked from the other side. That is a chalice or a gas mask. Interesting. seems to be alive. G -g 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 gamer trap. Seven hits. Oh, hello. These fellows are happy. Ah, yeah. <laughs> How's that go? Only those who know the beating heart of John Gibson's creation. being too nice about this game. What do you mean? What's going on? That was stupid. You mean it's worse than that? It's stupider than that? Ooh, interesting. Fuck off! give you a, light, a button to toggle between your weapon and your light. I mean, come on.
Okay, that was pretty spooky. Kudos. That hand be gripping that ball like good. Awful torture machines. They don't appear to have been used in a long time. Jeez. This thumb screw with a pair of agony, and I don't know if they're one. I shan't say. No, say. Say it. Speaketh thou must. Yep, that's me. Right there. That's me. And that's the uh, more charismatic and dominantly persuasive twin uh, who has some sort of unique hold over me, apparently. Thou shall. Yesterday afternoon, a terrible event occurred within the Wildberger Mansion, more commonly known as more commonly known as the Wildberger Hospital. Staff reported the disappearance of Dr. William Wildberger's daughters, Anna and Emma Wildberger. The police tried to interrogate Maria Morissette, the children's mother, who was in, found in a medically induced coma. Her doctor stated the unknown illness the woman is suffering from caused the coma, then it's not medically induced. Dr. Wildberger is currently away on traveler. Travel. Yeah. As this report is being written, Cruz continues to search the areas near the mansion. Our sources have informed us that the frogmen are on their way to assist the search of the frog areas. The sources have informed us that the frogmen are on their way. Good news, everybody. The frogmen are on their way. These girls are the same twins as those in the photo. The ones that will awaken the devil are ready for their operation. That's not what it says. What does it actually say? Are ready to be operated. It seems like the girls are being prepared for some kind of surgical procedure. These notes were dated from 14 fucking years ago and you're in your mid 20s. Do you not get it? If I don't find them soon, something terrible might happen. The signs of, the, you know, the, the abandoned building, you called it the old abandoned Wildberger Hospital, etc. cetera, et cetera. The plaque says Anna and Emma. God. These girls are okay. the same twins, the ones that, it's, if I don't find so them, so here's the, the thing. says Anna and Emma. If the, if this girl right here is not one of these girls, then this art style has severe same face syndrome and this girl may as well just be a triplet. Cause she looks exactly the same. Oh Jesus, that was weird. If that, you fucker! I fucking knew it. gets stupid oh my god so i'm i'm literally giving the game too much credit the kind of cliche plot that i've stated is giving it too much credit oh god okay <laughs> i'm guessing you looked it up not just have you know what let's move on right let's move on just move on Nat Geo 
you mess around with NFTs, National Geographic, you are dead to me. The West Wing second floor fuse is blown again and I run out of spares. These things are giving me a headache. All it needs to do is pass electricity through. I'm sure I could find something conductor to do the job in the meantime. You know, I saw a review that called this the greatest survival horror game of our generation. This will work. That would work. Whatever. <laughs> they called it the greatest survival horror game of our generation. And like, okay, I'm not going to say it's the worst game I've ever played. Like, going off what I've played so far, it is not the worst game. It's actually pretty good with some, you know, some notable flaws. I'm looking forward to that dive bombing into oblivion. I really am. I am so looking forward to that. I mean, if you play the demo, it would seem like very good, I think. I recognize this Unity Store model. I know. That's the thing. If it continued with the same level of quality, it'd be like, it'd be pretty good. It'd be pretty good. I don't think it's gonna. Like everything you've told me doesn't seem like it's gonna. I have no idea what that's about. Why is there just like a jar of that pitch black peanut butter up here again? Why are you here? Sorry, I had to get some snacks. <laughs> I'm kidding. I had to plug my phone in. Ah, we meet again. Stop eating the mic like that. Oh, Father, baby. what are you doing here? Don't you see, child? I am eating some soup. God feeds my spirit, but I have to take care of my body. Oh my, what is this doing in my soup? Get rid of this thing, would you? I found some information about the twins. I think someone means to perform surgery on them. I see. There is an operating room on the West Wing. Who would do such a thing? I don't know, but I'm going to find out. Out. Partial thread bolt made of steel. Okay. Waiter, waiter, there's a partial thread bolt made of steel in my soup. You're still eating it? Real Wild Burger's diary. I started painting again. I was so afraid of the empty canvas, so intimate, so cold. The day I managed to overcome that fear, I painted from one side to the other, my brush wet with crimson paint. I did it with courage I did not know I had in me. Colors are good. I 
and the colors exploded on the canvas. The dead white became alive and slowly the canvas and I started to forgive each other. I was so focused that William caught me by surprise. He grabbed me by the waist and kissed into my nape. Kissed into my nape. That sounds worse. Kissed my nape. You look radiant, he whispered into my ear. I let my hair loose. The painting could wait. And then we fucked. <laughs> it's like 17 U's and then the little text gets smaller and then it like cuts off at the edge of the page. <laughs> You know, this is apropos of nothing, but one thing that I like to think about is that humans fundamentally, like our cultures have changed, you know, our institutions have changed, material conditions have changed, but fundamentally human beings have not changed. And there is absolutely at least a, a, a thousand occasions in history, just none we've seen recorded where someone's writing in their diary and then they wrote something like the local cultural equivalent equivalent of and then we fucked and we just didn't get to see it but it's still there it still exists and that just fills me with joy like people people have always found farts funny. There is never a point in recorded history where people didn't find farts or dicks or boobies funny. People always love them. James Joyce a little too much, but like... The fuck is this? Oh, the fuse. The fuse. The fuse, the fuse, the fuse, the fuse, the fuse. We got enough nails. I think this is the way to the fuse. <laughs> yeah, and then up here. If that didn't work, I would have been very upset. That's a big bolt to be in your suit, bud. Without you noticing? Yeah? Maybe. <laughs> okay. The West Wing Corridor. You got it. I swear I thought that nails box said stinky. That's 10. Fuck. Ew. Wait a second. That's pretty cool. Why the spike going down to the brain, though? Is that a threat or like a surgery? I equals one. Oh my god, when I find that key, there are gonna be so many stupid puzzles. I can open it. <laughs> Gotta find another bolt or something. I want a fridge like this. Yeah, I want a mint green fridge like this, or maybe like a cherry red. Look at this fucking thing. It rules. The cool man. Oh fuck. I want I want a fridge that's called the Cool Man 420. And it's an amazing fridge. And it's just like a simple fridge in a freezer. No smart features. Just steel shelves. No glass. Fucking steel case 
thing weighs 600 pounds and it's five feet tall and it fits just enough food for two people and it works until the freaking heat death of the universe. Why did you say nothing here is useful? And why would I interact with this if nothing here is useful? Okay. Maintenance crew logbook. Dr. Colin reported that no matter how many times he pressed the bu button to call the elevator, it didn't work. When I checked on it, I realized that someone had left an object blocking the elevator door, stopping them from closing, closing completely. The buttons call the elevator from the first floor aren't working. The elevator can only be called from the second floor. Why did you just remove the object? going on here this place is infested with nightmarish creatures i need to be strong i can't quit now i've discovered that a surgical procedure is to be performed on two twin girls to be performed on twin girls i hope i can get to the operating room in time there's something dark going on something grim i wonder what country this is written in Oh, like a dead space because it's almost always worth it. The West Wing corridor. Those are guts. I thought that was like rags. What's up? Foul smell emanates from this body. I thought an object was left in the first floor doors. Hold on. Are you telling me that an object being left in front of the elevator doors is enough to stop the elevator from being called? Yeah? Yeah? Mm. So I need something else to... Oh, we the elevator. That means we can go up to the second floor. Grab the fuse. By the bolt. Now, I will admit, I have a definite weakness for puzzles where you transfer an item between a shortcut to unlock a successive door. I do like those puzzles. It's, they just make me feel accomplished. Imagine if I tried to grab that without <laughs> turning off the fucking... <sighs> but, but what? Where the fuck did I just come from? <laughs> Aren't here for good puzzles, huh? What are you here for? The bad puzzles? You want to see me suffer? Hmm? Is that what you're saying? You would like to see me suffer? How rude!
I'd have flipped. I had it flipped in my brain. Now to go to the elevator. And if the elevator says there's no power because it's broken. Oh my God. Oh my God. <sighs> it says the elevator cannot be called from the first floor. Doesn't mean you can't. Oh, okay, whatever. Whatever, whatever. Whatever. What? Ever. It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. It's fine. No, it's it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Shit. I did it in the wrong order. I don't know why I did that. We don't worry about that. Oh? Okay. Okay. Walk okay. 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 Ow! Sorry. I hit my mic stand again. That's what I'm supposed to do. I was like, I had to go over the puzzle in my head like, wait, wait. Yeah, okay, 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 okay. Okay. Okay, let's try this again, shall we? One more time. I'm Casey Casey. These are the best hits of today. Look, Casey Casey, we got the top 40 up here. All these songs fucking suck. That's okay. I'm not here to judge. I'm just here to play the hits. I don't need to call the elevator. The elevator's already there. shut the game off. All right. save. Thank you. Because that was a pain in my ass. Stop, stop. 
and if I die, I don't want to do that again. I am dreading boss fights. I am dreading a boss fight. Oh my god. It's gonna suck. Can you imagine? Hey, okay, it unlocks the door. Okay, and what's... 39. that room looked like immediately still not anywhere I know about oh come on I have an attached handle smells like sulfur oh bud oh joy Man in a radioactive suit is walking around a body in circles. Father, what's going on here? Why is that weird man walking around the operating table with that weird chandelier in his hands? Candelabra. What are you talking about, child? I don't see anything. Oh, you boy. don't see the man on the other side of the glass? It's not glass, it's wire. <laughs> oh. My child. This place is giving you hallucinations. You must rest. I don't know what's real or what is a product of my imagination, Father. Let me tell you a story. Hundreds of years ago, this island was inhabited by a tribe. Most places One were. Night. The moon could not be seen in the night sky, and the world was like many nights. into darkness. The shaman of the tribe, those with special blood, oh, danced boy. around their dead, willing their bodies to rise and walk the earth. Oh that boy! Terrifying. You, okay. If the crux of this game res revolves around anti-native xenophobia, I am... Someone please tell me, because then I'm just going to stop playing. Like, if this is if this is going to turn into, like, oh, Native Americans are the boogeymen, then I'm, I'm just done. something this body appears to have mop operating on multiple times it doesn't even look human anymore who's doing this it's gonna stand up when I do something important you know what we should do right now is we should get genuinely just shove like a crowbar into its brain pan uh, cause if it's dead, then no harm, no, no foul, you know, but it's not dead. We don't want it up again. Oh. Fuck. 
body was gone, that would have been pretty effective. This is the blood of the chosen twins. Huh. This what? Legends abound of the magic blood that courses through the veins of the twins, allowing them to communicate with each other even by thought alone. Don't claim that brothers and sisters could appear next to each other in seconds across comparable distances. It's not surprising that the first explorers who arrived on the island called such gifted younglings. Which children? Unfortunately, they seldom survived ten or eleven summers, once chosen for sacrifice. Striking tales of the knights with no moons in the sky, the knights and little twins were sacrificed. The one would dance, torch in hand, around the tribes to cease, while the remaining tribes would extinguish their torpses with this ritual the dead will walk the earth again at least for one night yeah gotcha so I have to walk circles around that thing when when it lights off oh oh you're a new one you're pretty cool but fuck various medicinal items. Oh! Okay, that's straight up supernatural. That is straight up supernatural. cool enemy design though. Oh, come on. Oh my god, the radius on that. The fuck am I? The enemies just keep getting upgraded. Is, is that what's happening? All right, here we go. You ready? Interesting. And I don't know what to do here. Okay, tell me, what do I got to do here?
But the guy was walking clockwise. Okay, fine. Goddamn nemesis, I bet. Yep. Now, what on earth is the reason for that? Pray tell. What is the reason? Because the game tells you to, probably. No! You can't move! Well, well you're reloading. Into that corner way too fast. He got games in his phone. Now I can't run fast enough to get a lead on him. because there was an object beneath him. Okay, well. Hmm. An old scalpel is very sharp. phone if you try hard enough. We've been duped, bamboozled! Oh, fuck. The design of this hospital is terrible. The architect was completely high. Straight up zooted. That's the shotgun. Well, if I get hit, I'm fucking dead. I don't even know where the... Okay, this is a save point in here. I'm gonna save before I take on that thing. just happened. Yeah? 
You have special twin blood, apparently. There was a dead creature lying on an operating table. It had blades for hands. After circling the body three times, it rose and tried to kill me. Did you not read the thing? I found an old scalpel. The priest told me it would have been used in the basement morgue. No, he didn't, because I haven't spoken to the priest. I should find some leads about the girls there. <laughs> oh boy, howdy. Game did not tell me that because I did not speak to the priest. I do appreciate that the weapons are handmade, though. Like, the weapons being a nail gun and a handmade shotgun actually is very apropos, because it's a hospital. Why the fuck would there be guns here? Why would there be guns here? There wouldn't be guns here. Generally speaking. for nothing. All the way here for nothing. All right, how do we get down to the morgue? From the main hall, come down and go through that basement door. should let us get the scalpel which lets us use which lets us uh open the rope in the trap door right there. okay okay I go slower now that I'm heavily injured, and I think that sucks. I think that sucks a lot. See you. Go ahead, lurk away. Where is the... I don't remember where... I don't remember where the... I don't remember where it is! Do you remember where the, the 
rope trap door was because I don't. I don't. makes sense. It gets us in the basement. Makes a lot of sense. Here we go. Mario. Where are you, Mario? Mario hit me. Mario? 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 Mario! You changed! Yeah, they told me. They told me. They told me. I feel like I'm developing this... This reputation as like a curmudgeon. And I don't want to. I'm not a curmudgeon. I'm very... I'm very happy. I'm very uh, easy to please. It just so happens that the things that bother me the most are the traps that people keep falling into over and over again very few things really bother me yeah not operational. Shotgun shells. Got it. Someone was living here. Nothing here. No morphine, huh? Bottle room. Oh, you were living here? Is it okay if I take some of your snacks? Can I have some of your Funyuns? Please. I would like some of your Funyuns. I'm not gonna take the whole bag, I'm just gonna like, have like a small bowl. Fuck me running. Maria's lost another child, this is the third. I do not know how I found the strength to not falter, but I must be strong for both of us. Damn it. Maria's condition worsens by the day. Her body may be damaged, but there's a mind that worries me most. She says not a word in her eyes to stop reacting when exposed to light. She no longer recognizes me and startles when I try to draw close. All the time she's so disoriented that she screams and breaks everything in her path. I can start for only with an injection. And then Maria, my Maria, is somewhere inside that damaged body. She worsens. Today I witnessed an awful sight as I entered the room. She stood in the pool of blood, lashing her own back with a whip. I grabbed her by the wrist, but she fought back with the top of her lungs. 
Call in a paramedic to help me. Sedate her and put stitches across her entire back. How she could do this to herself? Goes on inside her head. At least tonight she'll sleep soundly. By God, what have I done? Maria, will you ever forgive me? A year later, you in a day. Why am I lighting all these candelabras? Well, that's that. Yeah, I'm not going to continue tonight. <laughs> uh, I will take a look and see if this game is like, if this game gets racist, I'm not going to continue. Um, if it's just like tangential to the plot, I'll, oh, I will, I will consider continuing. Um, not the racism. I mean, if there's any racism, I'm going to stop. But if they're the talk of like, the native tribes isn't really continued, then I, I don't think it should be an issue. <sighs> There's a lot of movies that are like super racist, just in ways that a lot of people consider socially acceptable. Ugh. Anyway, uh, we're going to go ahead and see who else we got going. This game, y'all, this game. Oh, there's only four people here. You know what? No, we're not going to do it right. Uh, may or may not continue this game. We'll see. Uh, we're not going to do a raid tonight. I don't usually do it unless I have six or seven or more. Uh, but right now, what are we going to What are we gonna stream next? Sorry. Oh my god. I'm, I'm sleepy. <laughs> I woke up really late and I'm still sleepy. That's weird. Yeah, yeah. Considering the circumstances, I think that was still a pretty fun stream. You know, it's all about the company you keep. Um Right. So let me get a look. Let me get a gander at my work schedule. I'm getting a gander at my work schedule. Give me a second. Okay. We are... We are going to do something on Saturday. I think on Saturday, we're going to try something. I don't know what we're going to try, but we're going to try something. I believe there was an up-and-coming new release that I was pretty excited about. I don't remember what it was.